Division three in Ohio. This is the 2021 state championship final. Hermes in the blue, Campbell black and gold. The match is brought to you by Defense Up, Defense Up, Defense Up, Defense which is built. And Barbarian Apparel conquer the impossible, which Legacy currently wearing a Barbarian singlet on the edge. Campbell's going to clear back to the center. This bout was won by Hermes at the state duels. Thomas Campbell, Edison has to win this match. They won a chance. It's a six-point team lead currently for a legacy Christian. And if they want any chance at a team championship tonight, then there's going to have to be an Edison win here. It's, it's no if, ands, or buts about it. If legacy Christian wins this one, and one other, it is a done deal. Edison has three finalists here. Barnett, Shadrick Sloan, the Legacy Christian Knights. They have four finalists. Nothing yet here. No score. Scoreless bout. 32 seconds remains. First period. Hermes, Red, Ankle Band, Campbell. Green rematch from the state duels won by Hermes. And we're inside of 10 seconds remaining in the first period. Hermes Campbell going to be scoreless here in the first five now. And we're going to go to the disc flip in a scoreless bout here. And a must win match for Edison. The 106 pounds. Choice Campbell. The first. Hermes going underneath immediately. So scoreless bout. And then Hermes immediately up to his feet. Hermes knocked off Stephen Barnesville in the semis. One escape, Hermes. Campbell. Eli Campbell, a freshman, 35 and 4 on the year. Hermes, a sophomore. There's a two on the run, they're going to pull it down, go behind. There's Campbell, a little half shot there by Max Hermes. Hermes and Edison down by six points to Legacy Christian. This will close the gap, will still be in second after this. Legacy Christian is four finalists. Campbell, Campbell. But here to Logan Brown, Edison, three finalists. Edison, little room for air down by six points going into this one. Hermes, 
Campbell. One O lead, Hermes 53 seconds remains here in the second period. Hermes red on the scoreboard. Campbell green. And Eli Campbell, the freshman for the Legacy Christian. 35 and 4. Hermes with 54 wins. 54 and 4. Eight finals brought to you by Defensive, 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 which you built in Barbarian Apparel, conquered the impossible. We are inside of 30 seconds. 20 seconds left in the period. 1-0 lead, Hermes, Edison. Strategic bout here. Not a lot going on. And Hermes, five seconds away from taking a 1-0 lead into the third. End of the period. Gamble, Hermes. Nobody wants to blink. Oh, snap. We got both, both schools are in Barbarian Apparel, folks. Both schools. What a commercial. Listen, there's a 100% chance that they're wearing Barbarian Apparel in the state finals in D3 106. And there it is. Goes down, and now Hermes gonna look to ride for the win here. Might get reversed here, but no, he's not gonna. Hermes putting a tough ride. Real tough ride on Campbell right now. Does have a 1 0 lead, has a stall to give 132 remains here in the third period. Max Hermes looking for his first state title, the sophomore, a district champion two years in a row, 106 pounds. Campbell got to make a move up there. He's getting ridden. Pretty tough. Tough ride there by him. Stall to give. 107 remains. Hermes. Got to be careful not to get dinged for stalling here. Campbell falls forward. Hermes put a tough ride, 50 seconds away, 1-0 lead, Max Hermes Addison. We're gonna keep his team in this team race and win the only head-to-head -head with Legacy Christian. They gotta have this, this is the recipe for winning it all. Knocking off Legacy and the only head-to-head -head is key. 30 seconds, Hermes 1-0 lead. Now he's got the wrist, crushed wrist, Max Hermes riding tough here. Looking for the win, no stalls, 20 now. Campbell glued to the mat, they might think Campbell for stalling, had to get his head off the mat. A beautifully officiated match. Campbell couldn't get off the bottom. Max Hermes, five seconds away. He's gonna get a state title. There it is, Max Hermes. Division three, 106 pound champ. With a ride out in Ohio, folks. You just don't see that often. One all win for the sophomore Max Hermes. And there it is. Hermes with the win. There it is. Edison closes the gap. I believe it's a two-point gap now. And there it is. Hermes picks up the win and a state title. So 113. Dylan Campbell, 2-0 this year against Cooper Shore. Beat him in the district final. Major decision last week, folks. The Shores are junkyard dogs. Dylan Campbell has had his number. Overtie shuck there for Cooper Shore. His brother Max will be next. Shore runs to a light. Oh, that crazy roar. Their game, folks, their game. Yet again, a double barbarian singlet. There's a 100% chance the state finalists in Division Three, 113 are wearing barbarian apparel. Because they are, folks. One of our partners, matches brought to you by barbarian apparel. And defensive, 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 which have built. So, scoreless bout here. Campbell has put it on shore twice this year. Oh, there it is, a shot. The 
can go behind Shore. I'm gonna tell you right now, Edison's a big fan of Shore right now. And there's two takedown on the edge. Right now, folks, you couldn't be a bigger Cooper Shore fan if you are a Mylon Edison charger. One escape immediately for Eli Campbell. And 2-1 lead, Shore. 38 seconds remains, period number. One shot, there it is, into it again. Beautiful counter offense for Shore. Campbell, Campbell, the district champ, undefeated on the season, 43 and 0. Shore, the junkyard dog. Cooper Shore, just a sophomore. Campbell, just a freshman, is a shot. Head inside, 10 seconds left in the period. Shin Wizard. Oh, nasty chips him down. Two takedowns. Caught in near fall flight. Campbell's in a great position. Is he going to get the full set? He is. Big five-point move, 16 lead for Campbell. Dylan Campbell. His brother just lost in the state finals the match before him. He's not fake. He's ready for this. So, 16 lead Campbell on Cooper Shore. Max Shore coming out next. 7-2 lead after the intentional release. Campbell, 7-2 on shore. These are your Division Three Ohio High School State Championship Finals. There's another shot, spin go behind there for shore. Runs them off in that 7-2 lead, Campbell. Side right side. Gonna score again here. Had a big five pointer thing at first. Nine to Campbell. Now, if you're a Milan Edison Charger, if you're getting a little nervous, the window starts to close. Obviously, don't count the shores out of anything. Absolute junkyard dogs. Here comes the tilt now. He's got it. Looking for bonus. He has tech called Shore before. 45 seconds left. Far half. A pinfall would be huge for Legacy Christian. There it is. Looking for it. Dylan Campbell looking for a state title. Looking to get his team the title as well. This is going to give them a cushion. And they're going to stop potentially dangerous. Potentially dangerous stoppage. Shore sure, gonna take an injury time. Right. Oh. Sure, shoulder got a little twisted up there. Time. It's down 15 to 2 to Campbell. And here we go. Back to action. Two more for Campbell. It's a tack, folks. Thought he had a pinfall there. He did not. Then Campbell working on the mat. Campbell. 15 seconds left in the second here. 
Gave up the first two points and is pitching a shutout since. Goes to the tilt again. That's it. For the second, going to the third. It's choice Shore. He chooses neutral. Down 15-2 to Eli Campbell of Legacy Christian Academy. The Ohio High School State Championship 113-pound final. And the spin go behind. He rolls. Catches the leg there. Scrambled legs here. Two takedown ends the match for Campbell. Campbell looking for a title. They're going to stop this thing. Campbell 43-0 on the season. Dylan Campbell, the freshman, looking to be 44 and 0. He scores two more points. Game over. Technical fall. Bonus points. And we need to keep pace with Edison. Edison won the match before. There's a shot. So Campbell, got to get this tag. Tag pin something. They need bonus. It's at 145. They got a guy. They got a guy at 145, Gavin Brown. Up here, they got a guy at 132. They got guys over tight, shuck. They can run him down. Two takedowns, 17-2. Dylan Campbell, legacy Christian, picks up a state title at 113 pounds in Ohio. Legacy Christian, one step closer to that team title. There it is. Here come the 120s, they're on the mat. Here we go, we're gonna have Max. And one Brandon Haas of Eastwood in the red. He's taking on 16 and 0 Max Shore. Shore Black Singlet once again. Miami East Black Singlets rocking the Barbarian Apparel. Barbarian Apparel Hunter the Impossible. Five out of the six first singlets, Barbarian Apparel. Gotta check and see that Eastwood one. What a barrel roll. Nice recovery by Han. Shore missed a lot of the season. We're gonna run him down. Is Max Shore? He's a state runner up. Han's a placer. Han is stingy, very stingy. You'll love to see it. Great attack by Shore. His brother just got tech fall. The finals. His sister. Sixth place at 106 pounds. So one, two, three punch for Miami East at 106, 113, and 120. Han, the senior from Eastwood at 120 pounds. State finals. Han fires off a shot. Matches by the defense up, defense up, defense with your belt. And a whole bunch of barbarian apparel, folks. I believe the Eastwood singlet is a BA singlet as well. No, it's not. That's how it goes. So shot, sure, a little dump there. Now stepping over and stingy the defense just runs down a simple takedown, two takedown, and that's sure. Con the senior. Max Shore the junior undefeated on the 16 and 0. 120 pounds, Division 3 Ohio High School State Championships. Unable to get away. And we're going for this play. 2 0 lead Shore after one. Choice Shore, he's going underneath. Max Shore, the junior, 16 0 on the year. Taking on Eastwood's Brandon Hahn. And a headstand, got up and out immediately. Shore 3-0 lead. 
escape in the first five seconds. Shot Han from space. Trying to have a cradle now. And now he's trying to isolate that foot. Sure could have Han and Abo. What a trouble. Han trying to belly down. Trying to look it away from it, not into it. And Shore's going to take him over. Shore, what a ball! There it is! Matt Shore picks up a state title. And his family is pumped. His coaches are pumped. There it is! Matt Shore with a ball over Han. There it is! Stuck in the cradle. Wow. Shore with the title. Wow. So here we go to 126 on the mat. Matt's is brought to you by the Vents of 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 the the Impossible. And you are looking at the 126 pound final. Look at that. Cornish of Wayne Trace, he's in the red. Allen of Mechanicsburg. Cornish, Jared Hornish, a junior from Wayne Trace. Cornish, 43 and 4 on the year. Trey Allen, 40 and 1 on the year. Allen in the gold singlet. Cornish, red singlet. Cornish, Allen. Scoreless here so far. Shot there's a go behind now for Allen. Off of Hornish's shot. Hornish on the edge. Runs out of real estate. Wait. Wait. We got a restart. Off the restart. One minute eight seconds. Keep him standing. right now down 2-0 to Allen.
Six. Injury time. Division three, 126 pound Ohio High School State Championship. Here in Ohio. And up and out, Hornish shoves him off the mat. Still in control for Hornish. Hornish of Wayne's race. Jared Hornish is a junior, 43 and 4 on the year. He was a runner up at the district to Trey Allen. This is a rematch of the district final. Frank and Power have uh, is looking for it again. Allen could be in some trouble here. Working him over pretty good here. 47 seconds left in the second. 2-0 lead Allen. Hornish. Hornish cranking on Allen. Allen shows underneath. He's almost got him turned. It is close. Allen's fighting. And 25 seconds left in the second. Hornish working on top. Allen's got the only points though. Inside of 15. And Hornish and Allen. Hornish gonna ride, period. And it will be Hornish's choice in the third. He's going under. He's ready to go. So Jared Hornish, a lean trace underneath. Red singlet. Trey Allen, the district champ, knocked him off in the finals last week. Escape immediately for Hornish. Hornish needs a takedown here. Allen has not been warned for stalling. So Hornish is going to have to go get one here. Oh, nasty little duck into the double. And Allen catches up with him. Great defense. Oh!
Major decision to win the duel. Matt, the state champ two years ago, but you're a placer. Matt headed to Michigan, LaCour. LaCour is just a junior, 34 and two on the year. Zach Madden, 51 and one. His only loss is to LaCour. So if you are Edison, you've never wanted Zach Madden to win so bad. And LaCour, Pure, oh, that was nice. Hit him with like a little, caught him in like a crazy scramble for a six pointer. Great hustle. Pure has been hammering people all weekend. He's at a pin. 10 5 1 and a 13 5 major decision. He was so nice. And Matt with a 5 1 win over Long. That was a great match. Scoreless here so far. A minute is off the clock. So LaCour. Cameron LaCure, Zach Madden. LaCure, half shot there. And then Madden wrestled in the state duels. LaCure, 11 2 winner. A lot of great rematches. Love some rematches. Legacy matches brought to you by Barbarian Apparel with Legacy Singlets. Barbarian Apparel can't be impossible. Legacy Christian, LaCure's team, looking for a team title. 22 seconds left in the first. And they extended their lead. Oh, nice front headlock. We're gonna run the corner. It's Cameron LaCure, gonna run out of real estate. 13 seconds remains scoreless here in the first Ohio High School State Championships Division Three Small Schools in Ohio. Madden, small school champ at 106 pounds two years ago. Here are state places. Madden headed to Michigan. His brother Drew will wrestle Manzies next week. A little Cole on the team as well. So three Mattens on the team next year. We're going to go to disc look after a scoreless first. So it's Matt. He's going underneath. So Matten underneath right out of the gate. One. First period, no, no score. And now Matten underneath. The pure will cover. And Madden quad pods up immediately. And looking cradle is LaCure. LaCure still in control here. Madden facing off, maybe looking sucker drag from underneath there. Up and out, 1 0 lead, Zach Matt with Delta. So LaCure won this and made the decision in the dual meet. Legacy, the runner up in the dual meets. They're currently winning the team championship. A little shuck. A little shuck throw by, kind of. And in the body now is LaCure. 120 remains here. 1 0 lead, Matt. He tries to mix him. 117 off the restart. I'm guessing the Mattens had a pretty good game plan. If you know anything about them, they're pretty intense guys. So now two on one for Matt. And now he's trying to put his hand on the mat. Isolate the one hand with the two on one there of LaCure. 52 seconds remains. Second period. D3 Ohio, 132. Marquee matchup. Rematch from the state duels. The Cure won the rematch. We got blood time. Up. So the match is brought to you by Defense Up, 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 Defense on Matt and they're getting it cleaned up. So 
the D3 Championship Finals here at Marion Harding High School. D1s were at Hilliard Darby. Division two, that was at Marengo Highland, Sparta Highland. So Lecure and Legacy were in black singlets. Brought to you by Barbarian Apparel. Men, they are gold. Legacy Christian is black and gold. Delta, black and green. Old black and green. They always usually got a little white accent in there too. Delta in third place. Two finalists. That man, Austin Kohlhofer. We're going to get back to action. 38 seconds left in the period 1-0 lead. Matten, here we go. Matten, here, here we go. Here, maybe the system, he pulls the trigger. Beautiful knee pull And Matten. And now he's trying to trip him down. Shin is it for Matten. And now, that's, and the guy just started counting points immediately. That was wild. That was wild. I've never seen a high school ref dive into back points that quick. Ten seconds left. The pure looking to score here. Trying to hook the down foot. Five, four, three, two takedown. The pure is going to have a two-one lead going into the third. It's his choice. So two-one lead. Beautiful shot by Lacure. Lacure. Oh man, that was nice. Great exchange. That was wild. I've never seen someone count back points that quick. Whew. Getting it cleaned up here. 2 1 lead. Lecure. Lecure wins this match. Title's going home with Legacy Christian. Blood time. Felt the guys out there getting it cleaned up. Robin Rayfield. Legend in the sport in Ohio. Multiple team championships with Delta. He's like a legend. They retired. I don't believe it. So LeCure looking to put his team over the top here. They got bonus from Campbell at 113. A LeCure win. And then you put it in the hands of the always dangerous Gavin Brown. Freak of nature. LeCure. And Matt and two pretty different body types. Pure, short, stout. Matt and a little longer and lankier. So, we're going to find out. Sprint to the finish here. We're in the third period. It is choice up here. Cameron up here has choice and a 2 1 lead on. Zach Matten. And that was a nice one. Matten just dried himself off on his coach's suit coat. There's always been zero reps, man. This wants to win. Matten on top. The pure enemy. 2 1 lead Cameron with you. Pure up immediately. Beautiful roll. And I don't know how you're going to hold that right on. Holy smokes. Beautiful power stand up, up and out, runs out, does Cameron look here. Legacy Christian looking to give his team a title here. Matten down 3 1. Matten got to chop wood here. I mean, he's going to need multiple takedowns because it does not look like what I just saw from LeCure that a ride out will be a thing. Matten isolating that 2 1 1. 3 1 lead. 125 remains. Third period. Zach Matten, Cameron LeCure. Mature 3-1 lead Legacy Christian. A red ankle band for Mature. Mature doing what he needs to do, hanging out. Head taps, fakes, moving in and out. Trying to isolate the arm, dig a hook maybe. Now two on one for Mature. Still two on one for, now two on one for Matten. And tries to put him down the mat, he's on a single now. Dives to a single, potentially dangerous. That's one of those ones.
as the crowd's like, hey, put himself there. Super flexible knees by LaCure. So, 49 seconds left, three on lead, Cameron LaCure, legacy Christian, looking to knock off Zach Manton. Oh, they shoot at the same time. And Matt got popped in the face, good. Two takes on five, one, he rolls, he's out, down five, two, 35 seconds. LaCure can put on the track shoes at this point. And now he's in on a shot. Madden probably going to try and mix him here, folks. 24, now he goes back to a dunk. with a near ball. Two, take down, 7-2. And there it is. The Cure's going to put his team over the edge, speeds him a forearm. He's going to pick up a 17 win, and he's going to win the rematch that he won the, re the match of. Five, four, three, two, one. Cameron LaCure is just a champ. He went on 32 pounds. Four, Legacy Christian, and he is pumped, and his team all oh, but has the title in their hands. We'll know after 145. LaCure with the win. Wow, great match. They clinched it? Yeah. Stand correct, but Cameron Lecure just clinched it for his team. Barnett rocking the Barbarian apparel. Conquer the impossible matches are brought to you by Barbarian and Josh Shasky. As well as defense up, defense up, defense up, defense up. Casey Barnett and Hersey. Going at it here, Barnett, state champ. As a freshman, now as a senior, Hersey looking to go behind. So Casey Barnett. 56 and 1 on the year for Mylon Addison. And they need him big time now. Well, mathematically they can't win, but Legacy Christian just clinched it. If my, if my calculations are correct. Yeah, Logan Hershey, Hershey of New Thunder's Come. And the team is going through Cradle. Look at the mix now. He's got that Cradle, nothing yet. Not, and he goes for it. He's got him roll through. Hershey looking for it. He's got Barnett a bunch of trouble. Oh, there's the slide. Hershey could be looking for a fall for the newcomer's down. And Hershey gonna be up 5-0. No, he holds it. Now Barnett's gonna stop him. Barnett, the pin king in Ohio with 163. He's got Hershey in control, but there's near falls. Oh my goodness. What an exchange. Five to four, Hershey. Five to four, Hersey. Wow. What an exchange. This is 138 pounds. Championship finals, Division Three, Ohio. Casey Barnett with 164 pins in his career. He's the Ohio pin king. Logan Hersey, 48 and 0 from Newcomers Town. Both guys seniors. And now, Barnett, Hershey's in some trouble. Came out and there's the ball. The big thing gets the job done. There it is, Casey Barnett. Whoa, what a match. Both guys were in a position to pin each other all the time. And it was the first period. Casey Barnett gets the title. Wow. That's unreal. And his dad, Tom, is pumped. The 145s are on the mat. OHSA Division III State Championship here in Ohio. Going to be looking at Gavin Brown in the Black Barbarian Apparel Singlet. That's what he's bringing in these matches. And defense soap. He is taking on Shepard of Norland, Gavin Brown, committed to the Ohio State University. This is 145 D3 Ohio, 2021. Austin Shepard, the senior from Norland, Preston Norland. Colin Moore, Preston Norland. Austin Shepard, red singlet. Gavin Brown, black singlet, green ankle band. 
Brown's Legacy Christian team clinched the title. If my math is correct, they clinched the title. But a Brown win for sure clinched the title. Two take down to Evan Brown. Five seconds. Gavin Brown gonna take a 2-0 lead into the first. So 2-0 lead. Brown, he gets choice, he's gonna go under. Gavin Brown. Up 2-0, we'll go underneath to start the second. Seconds burns off the clock. Brown, a state champion, is a freshman. A junior now, no state tournament last year. Shepard, the senior. Austin Shepard, 30 and 1 in the year. Brown, 39 and 3. Brown looking for a reverse team to get that. But I know a fall here for sure clenches it. Looking for the fall, Gavin Brown. Shepard, good fight down. He's just going to recover off that. No near fall count? No, there's two. No, he got three. No, no, no. I didn't see him holding any in his digits. 25 seconds remains. Second period. Gavin Brown doing Gavin Brown things. He's up 7 0 on Shepard of Preston Williams. So, Legacy Christian will be taking the gold trophy home and getting the job done tonight. Two of their first three finals. This is their fourth finalist in Gavin Brown. Shepard's choice down 7 0. Looks like we got some blood. Yeah, Gavin Brown had some blood in his son. They had to make him a chin diaper. Chin diaper out of tape. Are they going to go chin diaper again? Yeah, they're going to go chin diaper. And by chin diaper, I literally mean that guy is about to tape a napkin to his face or and or gods. Catch us the blood. So 
to start the third. Austin Shepard neutral in the third here. Brown and Shepard 7-0 lead. Gavin Brown. Oh, little shuck by, throw by to a single, gonna cut it across to 9 0 Gavin Brown. He's letting go. He's letting the he's let his teammates know and his coaches know. He knows. In the summertime, I asked him if they could win the team title. He told me they were gonna win the team title. And told me that it was gonna happen. There's a state tournament, we're gonna win the team title. We at least backing it up right now, folks. It's what we call walking the walk. He already, he already talked it. <laughs> He's backing it up. As you can see, 9-1 lead. 58 seconds left. They only have nine guys on the team. They didn't come with all nine. So they made the state duel finals with nine guys. That means you've got to be near perfect. You have to pin everybody almost. But you can't lose matches. They made the state finals. There it is again. 11 1, Gavin Brown. Doing what he does. Picking Shepard apart. Looking for a second state title here. Exclamation point for his team. There's the tilt. He already got some near falls here. Seconds. And Gavin Brown is a stalemate with eight seconds. And his team are going to win with an exclamation point here. They're going to take three out of four finalists. And we got blood. So Brown, Shepard's got to get some blood off of him. Talking to old Jared, Jordan Marrero there. Hit him with the high flyer, I'm guessing is what he just told him. Big high flyer. And Shepard's gonna be under eight seconds left. Brown drops down on a single. He doesn't want to give up that point. Gavin Brown major the second second state title, team title. I think that's OW material there. Gavin Brown gets the job, then he's just each other, 145 pounds in Ohio, D3. So the 152s are on the mat. Going to be looking at this. Geezer, Geezer. Of Delton. He's in red. Taking on Palmer of Buckeye Local. Buckeye Local will be green. Geyser will be in red. Shot Geyser. Geyser looking to clear that leg off. Got the down leg hook. We're going to score her. Now looking to foot pass is Palmer. Senior from Buckeye Local, 42 and 1 on the year. Carter Geyser is 38 and 3. Geyser in on another shot. 38 and 3. Geyser in on the shot. Geyser a junior. Geyser is a huge upset round of the first undefeated host of Michelle in the quarterfinals. So Geyser's a gamer, folks. Brian Palmer, the senior, 42 and one for Buckeye Local. Scoreless bout here a minute in. Geyser and Palmer. Nothing doing. Thirty 
five seconds left here in the first third between Geyser, Belton, and Buckeye Locals. Glenn Palmer. Palmer, Geyser, scoreless here. Inside of 20 seconds left in the first. Palmer, Geyser. Oh, nasty dog! Oh, short time roll! Two takedown, that was nice, five seconds left, and that was, wow, he disappeared. Where'd he go, he teleported. He teleported, that was nasty. Brian Palmer, a dirty takedown. It was a dirty takedown indeed. <laughs> Nasty duck under to end the period. Two a lead. We got some blood to clean up. On guys. So guys are cleaned up. It says the choice in the second. He's gonna go underneath down to oh the former. Buckeye. Nasty teleporting duck under. Up and out as Geyser down 2 1. Homer, the senior here at 152 pounds. Both guys looking for their first state title. Buckeye Local, Ohio River Valley. Dalton is right around Canton. I guess you could call him Northeast Ohio, but not quite for. Eh, you could. You could geographically sit for Buckeye Lake. David Bertolino, my guy. He's from Buckeye Lake. Who's the state champ for him? All American for Bobby Douglas at Iowa State. This is shot by Geiser. Geiser is going to score here. Palmer from the pass. Better position for Geyser. Barbarian Apparel, Concrete the Impossible. Guys are rocking a BA singlet, Barbarian Apparel, folks. A lot of Barbarian Come Apparel on. sightings in the finals tonight here in Ohio. So two one twenty five seconds left. Palmer, Buckeye Local, Geyser Dalton. Geyser's pressing, shoves him off the mat, five seconds for me. Clock didn't stop, we lost three seconds on the clock, they set it back to six. So no harm, no foul, we fixed it. Like immediately. So Palmer gonna take a 2-1 lead into the third with Choice Palmer going underneath. D3-152 final here in Ohio, 2021. Palmer, Buckeye left with 2-1 lead, he's underneath. Guys are gotta go get one here, lets him go. Guys are Palmer, right hands, right Palmer. 
They're trading. They're trading shots back and forth. A little weak sweet looking attempt there. And he's got some blood, get it cleaned up. 3 1 lead at 129 in Getting the blood off the mat here. Palmer, 31 ladies in the driver's seat. Brian Palmer, the senior, 42 and one on the year. Looking for his first state title. Tate Geyser, Dalton, the junior, 38 and three on the year. Geyser, Palmer, 129 remains. Geyser, red, pressing forward, he's in the black and orange, Palmer, he's in the silver and blue, red ankle, green ankle man. One minute and five seconds remains here in the third period, 3-1 lead to Palmer. Shot, Geyser, shot again, Geyser, shot again, and now looks a little go behind there. Palmer, Geyser, another shot. He is peppering in the shots. Nikki Jordan style. Can't get one little shot by a top there now. Palmer, another shot. Another shot. Go behind to ice it. Go behind to ice it for Palmer. He's not going to get it. We're going to be off the mat. 31 seconds off the restart. Guys are gonna go get one here. He's down 3-1. Palmer probably gonna get one for stalling here. 20, there's the stall warning on Palmer. 15 now. Shot guys are go behind two. Palmer is gonna pick up a state title 5-1 here. In Ohio at 152 pounds in D3. Up D3 Ohio, Hayden Tummel, Indian Lake going to take on Shedrick Sloan in defense up, defense up, the Tumble Jibo and Barbary for the Impossible. Here we go, 160s are on the mat. Sloan, Tummel, Sloan, Orange, Tummel, West.
Almost gets to the leg. Damn it. Zero zero, 52 seconds left in the first period. Sloan versus Pummel. seconds in the first. Remaining. Guys go church. I don't think he's gonna have enough time. Green's choice. Sloan the first. Almost. Almost says let's go neutral. Full five count in. Bumble to work on top here again. Got a Turk. Got to get his hips in. And he decides to reset. Gives the ankle band back to the official. Forty-five seconds left. Second period. Bumble with a seven-zero lead. Going Turk and looking Turk again. Gotta get a better view there. 25 seconds left. Second period. So 7 0 pummel. He wants to take top. Sloan's going to take top. Got to some turns here. Gonna make this score 10 to 0 in favor of Pummel. Opponent. Go 
out of bounds. Okay, restart. 51 seconds left on the clock. Score is 10 to 0 in favor of Hummel. Seal off. Fights hands. Looks for switch. Fighting hands again. Humble follows. Fifteen seconds. A new champion at 160 pounds, Division Three, Ohio High School State Wrestling champion, Aiden Pummel of Indian Lake. He's fired up. This coach team dressed to the occasion as well. So the rules are on the night. County rematch. This wrestled, I think, 37 times. Seve Garza of Rittman. And his opponent from Rainbow. At 170 pounds is Lana. Garza. 40 and 0 on the year from Rittman, a senior. And these guys wrestled last week. We got Peyton Lemon. Lemon in the green. Garza is undefeated in this matchup. Garza is looking to become his school's first state champion. He's in the red single. Wayne won a team title. Nothing new for them. Peyton Lemon, the junior, 30 and 4. So undefeated Garza. Looking for a takedown here. Garza in on a shot. 2021 Ohio High School State Championship Division 3. Sally Garza in on a shot. Not just budget, but a fence up, defense up, defense up with your boat and barbarian for a point of impossible. 50 seconds left in the first. Lemon's going to be able to defend that one off. So, Garza was right there for a takedown. Couldn't get it. He is a senior. Undefeated senior. For Rittman. He's 40 and all on the year. He's beaten Lemon three times this year. Green County matchup. This one's for Pride. And a state title. So 2021 here, D3 at Marion Harding High School. Garza in red. Lemon with the pinstripes, green ankle band. Inside of five seconds, and Garza and Lemon are going to be scoreless here after one this flip. And Lemon wins. He's going to defer. Garza going under to start the second scoreless bout here at 170 pounds. Division three Ohio High School State Championships. Small school division title on the line here. Legacy Christian, your team champs. Edison runner up. So Garza. 1 0 lead on Lemon. So Lemon and Garza scrapping it out here. Garza, the senior, Lemon, the junior. Hard tie there by Lemon. 
Garza had a nice shot in the first, couldn't finish it. Pulls the trigger again, swing and a miss for Garza. 115 left in the second. Garza, lemon. Garza, red singlet, lemon, pinstripes, gold, and brown. He is out of Apple Creek Wayne down. Wayne County. Fifty seconds left in the second. One of these seven guards has Rittman in the red. Lemon of Weendale, pinstripes, hand fighting back and forth, pawing at each other. Shot deep, single leg. We're gonna run it down to Seve Garza. That was beautiful. Catches that part of two, take down Garza. Garza's in a great position, 3-0 lead, 23 seconds left in the second. He can ride to the third, it'll be Choice Lemon. And Seve Garza, two on one, riding hard here. 170 pounds, looking for his first state title, looking for his school's first state title. It's a roll by Lemon. We're gonna be off the mat with two seconds off the restart left in the second period. Garza went and got that one. his feet immediately as Lemon he rolls out and gets his one. 3 one lead Garza. Lemon's got to go get one at this point. Garza, Lemon. Seve Garza, a minute and 35 seconds away from the school's first state champion. At Whitman. Looking to get King Kong off the school's back. As I say it, Lemon pulls the trigger on a left-handed head inside single leg. Garza shin whizzer. Lemon looking to step over. Now Garza keeps the hand. Lemon looking to step over and boot in. 106 remains. Now they're in a foot scramble. Garza now in a way better position than he was. 53 seconds remain. Now Garza in on a leg. Take down by Garza, ices this thing. Now Garza, two, take down. 5-1 lead, Subby Garza. Garza looking for a state title for Rittman. Can he get the job done? Right. So Garza, 5-1, Lemon tries to kick out, and Garza's going to knock him off for the fourth time this year. Wow. Garza picks up the win in his school's first state title as he knocks off Lemon away to Seve Garza with the title. And he is excited. The senior gets a title, Savvy Garza. Number one ranked Savvy Garza gets the job done. And the state title of Ohio. So 182 is on the mat. You're going to be looking at, well, first off, matches are brought to you by Defensive, 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 and Harvard, Conquer the Impossible. 182 pounds. Meyer from Archibald, 182, Division III, state championship match. Right. Meyer in on that two on one, see what he's going to do with it.
30 seconds left, first period. Score 0-0. Zero, zero. Meyer fired off two shots there. That's going to give us a scoreless first period. Corn toss comes up red. Green. Meyer chooses down. Bottom. Stewart's going to mount. Let's see what the second period has for us here. Meyer works up his feet, fight hands, fight hands. Gets his one. Gets him on the board, 1-0. Minute 45 left in the second period. 1-0 zero, zero for Meyer from Archibald. Meyer, in on that rush again. Can you get him down to the mat? On right the edge of the mat here. Tight, tight. Gonna get a restart. Fire! Oh! And Stewart comes back to the side of his own. Fire! Gonna decide to belly out. Two to one in favor of Stewart from Greenham. Thirty seconds left in the second period. We're all square at two apiece. Meyer, heavy on the head. A little bit of movement there. Two all at the end of the second. In the third period. Greenan's going to take some injury time. Shoulder. Greenan's been battling shoulder injuries all tournament long. Actually popped his shoulder out. He's Second match of the tournament. So, the clock's down to one minute left for the injury time. The green team does have a brace that's been on hand, but if they're going to use it, they're going to have to make that decision quick, fast, and in a hurry here. Doesn't look like they're making that decision right now. So 30 seconds left to injury time. Score is two to two. Green and choice. He wants to go neutral. And that's what we're gonna do. Two all. Trevor Stewart of Green is Carson Meyer of Archibald. For the 182 state championship title in Division Three for 2021. Myers in on the leg. He's fighting off Meyer. What they call Stewart. 
for Sweden, so he gets one point. That makes this a three to two match. Gabriel Meyer from Archibald. One point for three in the match. Tightly contested match here. We're getting down 115 left. Let's see what actually Meyer's in again on a shot, and they go out right where they did before. One minute and eight seconds left on the clock. For this battle between Stewart and Meyer. For the 182 pound state championship title in Division Three. Again, the score is three to two, 55 seconds left. Three to two in favor of Archibald, Meyer from Archibald. Thirty seconds left. Third period. Three to two. Meyer Marshall with the lead. Reset with eighteen seconds left. Fifteen seconds left in the period. Here, Josh! Let him want it! Let him want it! Let him want it! Stick him! And he gets the ball! He gets the ball! With one second left, Wyatt Miller from Oak Harbor is your 195 pound state champion in Division Three. It's his third win of the tournament. Three games and a major decision. 
I don't know, we might have an outstanding wrestler award. All right, next up, 220. Next up, Austin Tolson from Delta versus Cade Blimes of Otsego. All these matches are brought to you by Barbarian Apparel, Cotton and Impossible, and Defense Soap. Defend what you have built. We have Cole, Cole Holfer from Delta and Limes from Otsego. Minute 34 on the clock, 0-0 zero, zero, first period. I believe these guys are in the same district. the first takedown of the match. That'll make it two to zero. A minute left in the first period. Gets to work on top here. Seconds left in the first period. moving and he's out right away goes to the trip just gets gets the one then the two so that puts him up five zero he's gonna cut him that's gonna make it five one digging into that underhook on the left taking ground now all right we're gonna go back to the center Love there by Cole Hoffer. Hoffer. Love it. Another heavy club. Level changes, taps, level changes, taps, level changes, moving them around. Tries to get in on his own shot. Cole Hofer makes him regret that decision. He's going to spin around for two. He's going to make the score 7 to 1. Climbs up to his feet, gets his escape. 7 to 2 now. 34 seconds left in the second period. Taking a toll right now, you can see. 12 seconds left in the second period. He's scoring. Cole Hofer now 
builds his lead from up to nine to two. And that's gonna take us to the third and final period. It's gonna be Lyme's choice. He chooses to go down. Bullhalter keeping the pressure going forward. to nine to three. Tap, level change, tap, level change, heavy hands. Mm, always working. Digs in that underhook. Sit in there again. Mine doesn't want it there. Go out of bounds. That makes it 11 to 3. Forward. Forward. 25 seconds left. Walter's gonna cut him loose. 11 to 4 now. from Delta. He's pumped up, and he should be. All right, that brings us to our final bout of the, of the night, 285 pounds. We've got Jeff Meyer of Columbus Grove. He's taking on Eli Kribles from Allen East. Just a reminder, all of these matches are brought to you by Defense Hope, where you defend what you have built in barbarian apparel. We just had a big dad son hug going on here, right? I mean, you love to see it. But now we're ready for Jeff Meyer from Columbus Grove and Eli Kribles from Allen East. Kribles. I've been corrected. I believe it's Kribles. <laughs> the Z is silent like the G in lasagna. Meyer and Cribley facing off for the 285 pounds state title in Division Three. Team left on the clock. Slip his right under hook in there too. He's got double unders. Oh, not anymore. Dribbly shoots him out of bounds. Back to the center we go with 35 seconds left on the clock. First period, zero to zero.
a scoreless first period. On to the second. Point comes up green. That's Kribley's decision. He chooses bottom. Well, Kribley has decision. He chooses bottom. And we're going to start the second period here. Deep waist. Now he's grabbing an ankle. They're going to say they were out of bounds before there was any loss of control. So we're going to start back in the center. Ghibli working to his feet. Walked his hands to his knees. Maya looking flat now. He's got across the wrist. Oh. Ghibli gets his arm, his wrist back. And he's working, working to his face here, fighting hands, fighting hands. Meyer's gonna take him out of bounds. They're gonna call him for stalling. So that's Meyer's first warning for stalling. We reset in the center. Ghibli down, Meyer about to mount. Everybody sits first, catches the hand, now he's fighting the crotch hand. And he gets his one. The first points are on the board, it's one to zero for Cribbly. One minute left in the second period. Digging in that underhook again. This time on the left side. The guys are fighting and jarring for position. 30, 30. Seconds left in the second period. Score is 2 1. Ghibli's down again. 13 seconds. Meyer stops the first move. And that brings us to the third period. Scores two to one in favor of Meyer, who's wearing the red ankle band with a red sock. Meyer's going to choose down. Cribbly says, "I'm going to go optional start," and he does so. And Meyer's out. That brings the score from to three to one in favor of Meyer from Columbus Grove. Uh, arm drag action. All right. You go out of bounds. Minute 42 left on the clock. Really tries to hike it up. Double underhooks there for Kirby. Can he do something with it? Can he do something with it? Meyer doesn't like that. They go out of bounds. 51 seconds left. Final match of the night. 285 pounds for the state championship in Division Three. Thirty-four 
four seconds. Time for Cribley. 15 seconds. We stop the match. Headgear is out of position. You got to get that back in order. 15 seconds to go. Meyer with the lead right now. Three to one. Using the gray. And Jeff Meyer of Columbus Grove. Is your champion at 285 pounds in Division Three? Jeff Meyer, state champ, 285 pounds. Oh, big hug. Love it.